Minasan konnichiwa, Yuka des. Hi everyone, this is Yuka. In today's video, we will review new grammar patterns introduced in Lesson 44 of the Minanoni Hongo textbook. Without further ado, let's get started. Here are the grammar points that we will discuss today. First, sugimas. Second, the patterns yasuides and nikuides. Third, noun o adjective or noun shimas. And last, noun ni shimas. First topic, sugimas. The verb sugimas means to pass through or to exceed. When it is attached to another verb or adjective, the pattern expresses that a certain action or state is inappropriately excessive. Thus, it includes a feeling that is not desirable. It is equivalent to too much in English. So to say that someone drinks too much or something is too expensive in a negative sense, we use this pattern. The basic structure is verb in stem form e and na adjectives in stem form plus the verb sugimas. Note the adjective e and the negative nai are irregulars. So e becomes yo sugimas, too good, and nai becomes nasa sugimas, too little. Let's look at these two sentences. The car is very expensive. And the car is too expensive. The first sentence sounds neutral. The word very is used to show a higher degree of the adjective, whereas the second sentence expresses the idea of too much, or the degree is more than the acceptable level. Osake o nomisugite, masugu arukimasen. Osake o nomisugite, masugu arukimasen. I drank too much alcohol and now I can't walk straight. Tsukare sugite, nemure masen. Tsukare sugite, nemure masen. I'm too tired to sleep. Nimotsu ga omosugite, hitori de motemasen. Nimotsu ga omosugite, hitori de motemasen. The luggage is too heavy to carry alone. Aji ga kosugite, Takusan taberare masen. Aji ga kosugite, takusan taberare masen. The taste is too strong to eat a lot. Tsukai kata ga wakaranai desu ka? Tsukai kata ga wakaranai desu ka? Don't you know how to use it? E, setsu meisho ga fukuzatsu sugirun desu. E, setsu meisho ga fukuzatsu sugirun desu. Yes, the instructions are too complicated. Second topic, yasubi desu and 
Nikuides. From compound verb, we now go to compound adjective. The adjectives yasui and nikui can be attached to a verb to form a compound adjective that expresses that an action is easy or difficult to perform. So to describe something, usually the topic of the sentence, as easy to or difficult to, simply append yasui or nikui to the stem form of the verb. Note that the compounded form is treated as an E adjective, thus it can be further conjugated to its negative in past forms. Atarashi sojiki wa karukute tsukai yasui desu. Atarashi sojiki wa karukute tsukai yasui desu. The new vacuum cleaner is light, so it's easy to use. There are some instances that Yasui can be translated as up to, prone to, and easily when it is used with intransitive verbs. Kono kaidan wa soberi Yasui desu. Kono kaidan wa suberi yasui desu. This staircase is slippery. Natsu wa tabemono ga kusari yasui desu. Natsu wa tabemono ga kusari yasui desu. Food is perishable in summer. Ano sensei no hanashi wa muzukashi kute wakari ni kui desu. Ano sensei no hanashi wa muzukashi kute wakari ni kui desu. That teacher's lecture is complicated so it is difficult to understand. Kono kusuri wa nigakute nomi ni kui desu. Kono kusuri wa nigakute nomi ni kui desu. This medicine is bitter, so it is difficult to take. Ame no hi wa sentaku mono ga kawaki ni kui desu. Ame no hi wa sentaku mono ga kawaki ni kui desu. During rainy days, laundry is difficult to dry. Third topic, the patterns kushimas and nishimas. This construction combines adjectives or nouns in adverbial forms with the verb shimas to convey that something will become in a certain way or state. It is similar to the patterns ku narimas and ni narimas, except that the use of the transitive shimas denotes that the change of state is brought about by someone's action. Example, to become pretty will then be to make pretty. The sentence structure is Noun o i adjective ku na adjective ni noun ni plus the verb shimas. To transform adjectives into adverbs, you need to replace the final i with ku for i adjectives and replace na with ni for na. Adjectives. The difference between ni narimas and ni shimas. Let's compare these two sentences. 
Musuko wo isha ni shimashita. I made my son a doctor. Zubon ga nagai no de mijikaku shite kudasai. Zubon ga nagai no de mijikaku shite kudasai. The pants are long so please make them short. テーブルが汚いのできれいにしてください。テーブルが汚いのできれいにしてください。The table is dirty, so please make it clean. うるさいのできれいにしてください。Urusai no de shizuka ni shite kudasai. It's noisy so please keep quiet. Gohan ga owi no de hanbun ni shite kudasai. Gohan ga owi no de hanbun ni shite kudasai. The rice is plenty, so please make it half. And the last topic is noun ni shimas. Another common expression that uses the pattern ni shimas is when making a decision or indicating a choice. It can be translated as I decided to have or I'll choose. So the statement sushi ni shimas means I'll choose sushi or I would like to have sushi. Hikoki wa nanji no bin ni shimasu ka? Hikoki wa nanji no bin ni shimasu ka? As for your flight, what time do you want? Kuji no bini shimas. Kuji no bini shimas. I'll have the nine o'clock flight. Hoteru wa doko ni shimas ka? Hoteru wa doko ni shimas ka? As for your hotel, where do you want? Hoteru Hiroshima Nishimas. Hoteru Hiroshima Nishimas. Make it Hotel Hiroshima. Heya wa Shinguru Nishimas ka? Tsui Nishimas ka? Heya wa shinguru ni shimasu ka? Tsui ni shimasu ka? Will the room be single or twin? Tsui ni shimasu. Tsui ni shimasu. I'll have a twin. Shokuji wa washoku to yoshoku to duchira ni shimasu ka? Shokuji wa washoku to yoshoku to duchira ni shimasu ka? Which meal do you prefer? Japanese food or Western food? Washoku ni shimasu. Washoku ni shimasu. I'll have Japanese food. And that concludes our lesson for today. See you in the next one.